In the eons past, when the cosmos were but a canvas of uncharted wonders, a distant galaxy cast its gaze upon Earth, drawn by the lush mysteries of the Philippine rainforests. From the celestial expanse, extraterrestrial beings descended, their forms luminous against the backdrop of the night. With knowledge beyond earthly comprehension, they sought to intertwine their cosmic essence with the terrestrial realm. They wove strands of starlight into the roots of ancient trees and danced with the spirits of the rivers, their every movement an incantation of otherworldly magic. From their cosmic loom, they crafted a being both magnificent and terrible, a fusion of human and equine, a terror that would forever stalk the shadows. This unholy creation, born of intergalactic wisdom and earthly dread, was named Tikbalang. Its form, a grotesque tableau of twisted limbs and bestial grace, stood as a testament to the boundless depths of the universe's malevolence. Its head bore the wild, piercing eyes of a steed, and its hooves, sharp as the shards of a shattered comet, struck the earth with a resonance that echoed through the very bones of the forest. When it squatted in the underbrush, its elongated limbs contorted in grotesque angles, knees jutting above its head like ominous sentinels. A ghoulish parody of life it awaited in the shadows, eyes gleaming with an otherworldly malice. And in the twisted tale of its creation, whispered among the darkest corners of folklore, it is said that the Tikbalang's origin lies in the shattered dreams of an aborted soul sent from limbo to the terrestrial realm. A spectre of sorrow and rage, it roams the earth, forever haunted by the life it was denied. So it was that in the heart of the Philippine rainforests, the Tikbalang stood tall, a testament to the union of cosmic malevolence and earthly dread. A sentinel of shadows, it guards the secrets of the forest with a vigilance born of interstellar malice, a reminder that even in the grandeur of the natural world, there lies a darkness that defies mortal comprehension.